So back to what I was saying now, you know, to, to make this 360, right? From what I'm researching now, I see a major turn took place during the time when Tulsa created what we call AC electricity. You know, it was more of a weapon. It was a weaponization with that death ray stuff and where we get the movie Star Wars and everything. That was the game change in society. And once that came into play, it was now inside of us they was going instead of outside of us more with the tricks. I mean, the tricks is for the consumer and even the corporation owner who's not of the elite or shadow world. And then they themselves now just disappeared. Just like, think about it, what happened to the Mafia after um, Sammy the Bull and, you know, John Gotti, they all, everything just shut down. Like they said, yo, too much attention and everybody went and bought corporations. Once they left, Walmart popped up. Everybody started coming together. They did it to us again. There was no such thing as a mafia. That was a part of a plan. Every part was a plan to get ready for the next level. That's why it just disappeared. Like how Bin Laden just disappeared. Just like, you know, we could go on forever if we do the steps to building this up, but it's a simple uh, procedure. Once, you know, we going back to Telstra, once that was in and they started working with the psychic and learning um, how to utilize this chakra system they started up now another group of people this is all the Britons really they all came out of Britain Britain is the ones who sent some elites from really they came out of the Oriental from Britain and they sent them from Britain to the Oriental to make them the most elite of the elite as far as mind not fighting stuff and all that but the mind and then sent them to Germany and that's where they came together and eventually the best of the best after them for maybe this is talking about centuries they didn't just set this up in a week or one lifetime this is passed on through Greece and so when the Thole Society or whatever with Hitler came they was testing out all the psychic stuff and the equipment and the chemistry that we, is our modern day um, medicines today that we use that's all it was Hitler stuff that y'all is all taking sex drugs, all these medications was all brought to you by Hitler. You gotta thank him, y'all, for saving y'all lives today because he tested those on them peoples and that's how they learned all this stuff that they know. Then they went back and, and took off their fake Jewish, I mean, German outfits and all that and came back to the United States. They make it up like this project, paper and all this stuff and sending some Soviets back. But they was never from there in the first place. That's why you can't find them now. They just went over there to do that little trick and come back. And that's when they learned all the UFO stuff and everything disappeared again. Now we learn the shadow world. Everything is underground because everything was always underground. They just made it seem that way for a quick second to get a response, and then they know what the response and so they disappear and use it as a trigger now. That's what we have, trigger response. And we catching on, I mean, the 9-11 killed it. They had to get rid of Bush. Bush, you know, everybody know Bush. Half the drug dealers in America work for Bush. Everybody work for Bush. Trust me, anything illegal coming into the United States, they put it there. Why you think y'all ain't never gonna get no Mexican bridge or wall up? Who's gonna benefit from that if they did that? Think about it. That's the biggest campaign that will never work out because they're not gonna do it because no drugs, nothing happened. America got everything detailed, man. If a drug come to the United States, they sent it. They set it up. Remember that. Ain't nothing happening unless they do it. And until you figure that out, you realize coca don't grow in the United States. So they can't have crack or cocaine there because it's not there. Whoever is doing it, they allow it to come in. Right now, you can't even send herbs from over any other country to the United States while customs tearing your ass up. So how are they getting coca and all that and all this stuff y'all smoking out there? Through these corporations, man. People don't check well-known corporations with all them big freights and all that on it. So they slide that through and pretend that mafia is still doing their thing. Y'all gonna get me killed, man. Let me shut up. University of Conscious Science, one last.